Hello dear children good morning today i am going to continue the explanation part of our chapter 5 the plateau and desert regions in our previous class you have learned southern plateau location and their extent the central highlands the deccan plateau rivers right in today's class you are going to learn from the climate okay the desert remains hot and dry which desert the great indian desert the great indian desert remains hot and dry throughout the year so throughout the year this desert is so hot and so dry even the region receives very little rainfall which makes it barren and dry so this region receives very little rainfall because of its dryness which makes it barren and dry during summer days are very hot and nights are cool so during summers the days are very hot and at night it is so cold there during winters days are warm and the nights are very cold as usually during winters the days are so warm in the desert region and the nights are very cold there vegetation and wildlife vegetation in the tar is scanty due to the scarcity of water so there the vegetation is very low due to the shortage of water thorny shrubs and scattered bushes which require less water are commonly found here so we uh, we can found thorny shrubs and scattered bushes there because they require only less amount of water these plants generally have long roots that reach the deep underground water so the roots of these plants are very long so that they can reach to the underground water and take some water examples of such plants include cactus kicker and bubble so such exa uh, some examples of such plants are cactus kicker and bubble oasis are also found in some places an oasis here this is oasis we can see in the picture this is oasis oasis are also found in some places an oasis is an area in the desert where underground water comes to the surface and because of which some greenery is seen around it so an oasis is an area it's an area in the desert we can uh, found underground water which comes to the surface and because of this we can see some greenery at some places in the desert commonly animals such as camels call the sheep of the desert black bucks chinkaros and great indian bustards are found in this area in this area we can see camels which is the sheep of the desert black bucks chinkaras and great indian bustards are found some of the other animals found in this region are the red fox and caracal a type of wild cat so we can find red fox and caracal caracal is a type of a wild cat in this region next comes water system in the thar water system in the thar being a desert the thar suffers from water shortage so it is a desert so it feels some water shortage villages often walk long distances to fetch water so villages also go for long distances to get water to tackle this problem of water scarcity the government has built the indira gandhi canal in order to overcome this water problem the government has built the indra, built the indira gandhi canal it was earlier known as the rajasthan canal so this indira gandhi canal is previously known as the rajasthan canal river satluj and its tributaries 
supply water to this canal. So, where does water get to this canal? From where means river atlash and its tributaries. It is the supply chain to this canal. The canal provides drinking water and supports irrigation in the region. So, this canal provides water for drinking and for irrigation in this desert region. River Luni is the only river of this desert region. River Luni is the one and only river of this desert region. It is a seasonal river. The crops grown here include wheat, maize, barley, zowar and basra. So here due to the seasonal due to this seasonal river river luni the crops go grown here are wheat maize barley zowar and basra industries developed in the region include woolen textiles forestry coal and petroleum mining and tourism jaisalmer Bikaner and Jodhpur are the main desert cities. Here main desert, desert cities are Jodhpur, Bikaner and Jaisalmer. Ranthambur, Kyoladio, earlier known as Bharatpur Bird Sanctuary and Sariska are famous national parks of Rajasthan. What are the famous national parks of Rajasthan? Ranthambore, Kyolajio and Sariska are famous national parks of Rajasthan. Okay children, we will continue the remaining class in the next class. Once go through the today's class. Okay children, bye. Thank you.